Hey guys, exciting news in 2017, the most legendary, most hated, and most famous cheater in Magic the Gathering history will be able to play Magic again. I fully expect him to play Magic. I don't, do not expect him to be detoured by his second suspension. He was suspended once in 2011, came back in 2014, made light of it, and then was suspended again for cheating. He is a well-known cheater with little to no remorse for what he has done. He has won Power 9. He is the Star City Games champion. He is one of their best players and one of their most dominating Magic the Gathering players in the history of the Star City game circuit. Now, let's talk about what makes him such a good cheater. Normally, he was able to take advantage of something called gameplay warning, which if you get a gameplay warning, a, a third or subsequent warning for a gameplay error offense in the same category should be upgraded to a game loss. And a game loss is recorded. However, if you have two warnings, gameplay warnings, it is not recorded. So Alex saw that, and to maximize the odds of him winning, he would cheat at least two times in a tournament. Ideally, he would not be caught, but even if he was caught, as long as he didn't get free warnings, he was okay. Now, is Alex the only one to take advantage of this situation? No, but Alex is the most famous person because he won so many times. People don't really care about cheaters or they don't really make those of cheaters unless they're on video or they're winning a lot. And a lot of times we notice that these pro players who are doing extremely well, Jared, who just won every single game, you know, stacking his deck, all types of bad stuff. Another very interesting thing to note is Brainstorm. Alex draws extra cards off Brainstorm. His Brainstorm is even more powerful card draw wise than Ancestral Visions. Alex plays extra land off Explore. His Explore allows him to play two lands instead of the normal one. So he's obviously not playing by the same rules or the same guidelines. What makes him the greatest cheat of all time is he's done it at the highest level. He's won in this picture alone, $10,000, as well as Power 9, which is so much more worth more than $10,000 at this point in time. And he knows the interactions. He, If you watch this video, he does it very carefully. He does it very deliberately. He'll talk. A lot of the best cheaters in the history of this game are very social, very nice people. So I'm going to read a speech to... Alex to encourage him to come back to our game. Let me tell you something you already know. The world ain't all sunshines and rainbows. It is a very mean and nasty place and I don't care how tough you are, it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it. You, me, or nobody is going to hit as hard as life. But it ain't about how hard you're hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. How much you can take and keep moving forward. That's how winning is done. Now, if you know what you're worth, then go out and get what you're worth. But you're going to be willing to take the hits. And not pointing fingers saying you ain't where you want to be because of him or her or anybody. Cowards do that and that ain't you. You're better than that. You're always going to love you. I'm always going to love you no matter what. No matter what happens. So that is a quotation from Rocky for, for Alex to continue. You know, Come back to the Star City Game Circuit. Cheat some more. I'm sure, sure that everything will be fine. If you didn't get the tone of this uh, video yet, it is a comedy video. Obviously, I don't encourage Alex to return. But still, if he returns a, a third time, gets caught again, and then you have to give him respect, at least for the fact that he try, tries hard. Um, now, is he a good player? No. Is he um, going to continue to cheat? Probably yes. But I don't know too many people who got publicly shamed for cheating, came back, made a joke of it, and then cheated 
a few months later to be suspended again for multiple years. Alex Bocchini, the greatest cheater of all time. No doubt in my mind, he is legend. 